Hi, and welcome to the second Gmail Sites tutorial. In the last tutorial, you learned how to edit the home page and add pictures to your website. In this tutorial, you will change the appearance of your website and sidebar. So first, let's go to our website. On my Gmail page, I will go up to um, More, and I will click on the arrow beside More, and I will scroll down to Sites and click on that. When I click on Sites, it takes me to the My Sites page. As you see, I have three websites that I am a member of, and this is the one we will be working on today, Classroom Website. So I will click on that, and here I am at my freshly made page that has needs a little work. So um, I would like to change my background first. So I will go over to Site Settings, and this is where we're going to be doing all of our work today, is in this um, thing right here, Site Settings. So I will click on the pointer in Site Settings, go to Change Appearance, and click on it. And it will take me to my Appearance page. Um, first, I would like to change my theme. So I'm going to go over to Themes, click on it. And here, um, Gmail has already provided you with several different backgrounds that you can choose from. Um, let's see. Today, I would like to use Garden. So I'm going to click on Garden. And if you'd like to preview it, you can click on Preview. And um, it pops up and previews it for you. But I've decided that I want to use Garden. So I click on Garden. Click Save Changes. and then um, it should be saved. So next I would like to change my colors and fonts. Now today I'm not really going to change colors and fonts because there are so many options that you can do with colors and fonts. So all you have to do is just click on colors and fonts and as you see there are all these different ways that you can um, um, customize your website. So you can change the background image, you can change the link color, you can change the title, you can change the font if you scroll down a little further. There's so many options right here, so um, if you have time, you um, can do that yourself. So this is how you change the colors and fonts. Next, we'll go to Site Elements, and the next thing we're going to do in this tutorial is edit our sidebar. Now, the sidebar technically is called the navigation bar, but it's on the side. So I want to edit my sidebar right here, my navigation bar. So I'm going to click on edit and as you see these are the four um, items that are in my navigation bar currently. So I would like to add a page to my sidebar navigation. Now since all of those are already on there I'm just going to go ahead and add one that's already on there such as my recent site activity. So if I want to add a page to my navigation bar, I will select Recent Site Activity and click on it. And as you see, it highlights it and press OK. And as you see, another Recent Site Activity has been added. Next, I will click on OK, and that has been added. Um, this you can do with any new page that you create. Let's make sure our changes have been saved. First, we need to make sure that we go ahead and click on Save Changes. And then we can go ahead and go back to um, our web page. So click on Return to Site. And as you see, our background has been changed. And we have two recent site activities under our navigation bar. That concludes our tutorial about how to change your site appearance. Next, you will learn how to share your site with others. Thank you.